So, how's the overwhelm feeling? Is the breathing and meditation making a difference? Are you learning to walk away and get a new perspective and say no? Well, there's another side of overwhelm, and sometimes it's something we use to sabotage ourselves. What happens is that we could be asked to do something or we have an opportunity and it's a bit scary. It takes us out of our comfort zone. And so we go, no, 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 I'm too busy. I can't. I'm just overwhelmed with what I do. And that's a real shame because opportunities are there for us to learn and grow. So what I'd like to invite you to do as you go through the next couple of days, or it might be even not the next couple of days, but keep this idea in mind is that when somebody offers you an opportunity and you feel a little bit scared or a little bit challenged or a little bit stretched out of your comfort zone and you're just about to say, oh no, I'm too busy, I couldn't possibly do it. Just check, are you sabotaging an opportunity here? Are you stopping yourself moving forward and growing? Are you using overwhelm as a really handy excuse? And if you are, I invite you not to. Step up and say yes rather than no in that situation.